Hello everyone. Today's video tutorial is about modifying slides in the presentation. To follow this tutorial, you can open a PowerPoint file and insert some contents in it. So to begin, let's look at how we can copy and paste a slide to a given position within the same presentation you are working with. So assuming you want to copy this slide to and put it after slide 4 what you do is to first of all select the slide using the thumbnail then after selecting just under the home tab in the clipboard group click copy so when you click copy then you just go below the slide which is slide 4 first of all I will scroll down so below this slide 4 we shall click in between then when this line is uh, inserted there what you do is to go to this uh, paste button so you just click on the paste button and you'll have the slide inserted there so you have this slide for types of networks inserted below this one of these advantages so now let's look at how we can move slides within a presentation so we want this slide 6 just to come above this slide 5 what we shall do is to click hold and then move so as you're moving we can see that our pointer has some other feature below that is an indication that we are moving a given slide so as you continue moving, you will just see that line drawn below that slide 4. So that line is an indication that once we release our mouse button, then the slide will be inserted in that very point. So I will release the mouse button and we have our slide inserted just above this slide for types of network. So if you have some other slides uh, for example on top here and you want to go ahead and uh, move them maybe below so what you do is to click let's say slide 3 then we shall move downward so if you want it to be inserted there then you can click you can release the mouse button so when you release the mouse button the slide will just be inserted where the other line is drone then if we don't want some of the slides to appear in our presentation so deleting the slides is done from the slide pen so you select the slide for instance this one then we click on the delete and that slide will be deleted then we can delete some other slides by using the scroll button and then you'll access all the slides you have in your presentation so after scrolling assuming we don't need this one we shall click on it then go and delete you click on this one then you go ahead and delete then you remain with only the slides that you want in your presentation now that we have the contents in our slides we can go ahead and work with the slides tab and the outline tab so that we can see the differences between these two tabs so right now we have the slides tab which allows you to move the slides to copy and paste to edit to delete and so on so what happens if we switch to outline tab so i'll click on the outline tab so from the outline tab you can see now we have the contents of the slides displayed from this tab just like we said in our previous tutorial you can have a view of the title and the contents within each of the slides so here you have the contents and this is slide one you can just see from the numbering on the side so that's how the outline tab uh, displays the information or the contents in your presentation file then where we see the last slide which is slide 5 having the contents are uh, selected this means that this is the last uh, slide that you had selected from the slides tab if we can go back and select 
maybe slide 3 so we switch back to slide stop then we select slide 3 then if we go back to the outline uh, tab then you'll see that the contents under slide 3 will be the ones that are selected so that is it with the outline uh, tab in your presentation file so now we can switch back to the slides tab now we want also to look at how we can have a view of the slides when they have content so we want to look at the different view options so the current one is the normal a view then the slide sorter we shall click on it so with the slide sorter this is how your slides will be arranged or displayed still from this very slide sorter it gives you the easiest way to move the slides for instance if you want this slide uh, five to come just between this one and that one what you do is to click hold and then move now as you're moving you can see that line also drawn between slide four and slide five so if you release it means that our slide will remain there but we want it to just come in between slide three and slide four so when you reach there you release the mouse button then you'll see the slide inserted there if you want it to go back you just click hold and then uh, take it so when you see that line release the mouse button then you'll have the slide inserted there so that's how you can work with the slide sorter so we can go to the slide show view so when you click on it that is how the information will be displayed so when you keep on clicking that was our last slide so when you are on the last slide then the screen will appear blank simply because the slides are over so you can just click to exit so let's go back to the normal view option so when you click on it we shall go back to the normal view option so let's use the slideshow starting from the first slide so we shall click the first slide then you can press f5 on the keyboard so that is how the contents will be displayed when you use the slideshow view so when you click you'll keep on uh, moving or uh, transiting to the next slide so that is how we can work with those uh, different view options on the presentation so when you want to end at that slide then you can just press on the escape key then you'll be taken back to the normal view hope you found this video tutorial helpful to you that's it for now see you in our next tutorial